From letters I've received, I know that others are troubled by questions about the spirit world we will inhabit after we die and before we are resurrected. What do we really know about conditions in the spirit world? When we ask ourselves what we know about the spirit world from the standard works, the answer is not as much as we often think. Of course, we know from the scriptures that after our bodies die, we continue to live as spirits in the spirit world. The scriptures also teach that this spirit world is divided between those who have been righteous or just during life and those who have been wicked. The work of salvation in the spirit world consists of freeing spirits from what the scriptures frequently describe as bondage. All in the spirit world are under some form of bondage. The wicked also suffer an additional bondage. Because of unrepented sins, they are in what the apostle Peter referred to as spirit prison. There is so much we do not know that our only sure reliance is to trust in the Lord and his love for his children. In conclusion, what we do know about the spirit world is that the Father's and the Son's work of salvation continues there. Our Savior initiated the work of declaring liberty to the captives, and that work continues as worthy and qualified messengers continue to preach the gospel, including repentance, to those who still need its cleansing effect.